Thank you. Hello, today is Monday, August 31st, 2015. I'm your host, Steven Sanchez, and this is Marijuana Minute. In the month of July, the National Cancer Institute of Health made an update on their website. This quiet update declares and concludes that the anti-inflammatory effects of oil, tea, or food ingested, even smoked or sprayed on the tongue, may help those with pain relief affected by cancer. This study is still in its maturing stages, but had positive anti-tumor activity when cannabinoids were used as a treatment on lab mice and rats. As of now, the two types of cannabinoids, dronabinoids and nabilone, are approved by the FDA for nausea and vomiting resulting from chemotherapy. The American Cancer Society wrote on the website, while the studies have so far shown that cannabinoids can be safe in treating cancer, did not show that they help control or cure the disease. Relying on marijuana alone as treatment while avoiding or delaying conventional medical care for cancer may have serious health consequences. The Orange County Register of California reports a swag story on an incident involving a raid conducted by Santa Ana cops in May. Although the dispensary was unlicensed, the cops were caught on video after the fact munching on cannabis-infused chocolate bars and playing darts. One female officer can be heard during their after-raid party stating, I was about to kick her in her fucking nub. Speaking about the acting manager of the Sky High Holistic Dispensary, who is a legally blind amputee. Recently, these three suspended officers are trying to stop internal affairs from an investigation. The suspended officers in a lawsuit claim they thought they disabled all security cameras at the dispensary and therefore had a sense to believe a sense of privacy, also claiming the facility never got their permission to record them. Ironically, the dispensary foresaw this raid coming and installed hidden cameras, which caught the public officials in enjoying themselves. California law says all parties to a confidential communication must consent to being recorded, and they never gave their consent. But according to Orange County Judge Ronald Al Bauer, the cops had no objectively reasonable expectation that their words and actions would not be observed while performing their official duties in a business that they had just raided. Evidently, Judge Bauer burned that claim up in smoke. This episode of Marijuana Minute is brought to you by Roughhouse Studio Shop. Shipping vaporizers and other smoking accessories worldwide at great prices. Use the code Marijuana Minute to save 10% off your order. This has been Marijuana Minute. Until next time, keep the peace and be safe. And keep your peace safe.